Welcome back, demons. At one point or another, we've all experienced what it's been like to be at home doing sport virtually in our pajamas. However, there were some students who decided to remain virtual longer than others. In this week's episode of LE TV, we'll be having a look at what it was like for these students to return to the hallways of LE once again. But first, let's have a look at this week's announcements. Tomorrow, Saturday, September 18th at 7 p.m. on the football field, there will be a ring ceremony to celebrate the 2020-2021 varsity softball team who is named the South Carolina 4A state champions. There is no cost to come to this ceremony. Tuesday, September 21st at 5.30 p.m., JV Volleyball plays r &E and Varsity plays at 7. We hope to see you at these events in honor to support your Lady Demons. August 5th marked exactly 510 days since every LE student had been in the building. That means around 17 months had passed since the full student body was present and students didn't see all of their classmates or teachers. But on the first day of school this year, all of that changed when around 1,700 students returned to these halls. When Governor McMaster announced that Kershaw County would go virtual March 13, 2020. Effective immediately, I have ordered the following. Schools in Kershaw and Lancaster counties to be closed Monday, March 16th and remain closed for a minimum of 14 days. Students like senior Orion Baker were excited and saw it as an opportunity to do things that they wanted to do. I was doing all right. Um, I started exercising more, put in a diet. So I started losing weight, started going to the gym. I cared more about my grades and life was all right. However, virtual learning was not all positive, especially after the new wore off. Many teachers and students struggled. Uh, after we remained virtual, I kind of tanked. Um, it's very hard to care about school whenever there isn't really any external motivation or supervision. Inability to collaborate, uh, the ensemble aspect of, of what we do in band is lost. Um, and I, to be honest with you, uh, the real issue I have with the virtual environment and music is the real-time interaction, the ability to read the student, read the body language diagnose in real time what the need is. If, if you're not self-driven and self-motivated, it's just way too easy to just turn off the computer or open up another tab and do something else and hear the teacher less and less and get be engaged with the other students less and less. Despite the struggles many experienced, students like Tyler Doctor chose to remain virtual last year. That's what most times stress from like other people taking tests and finishing before me in the time limit. Now, even students like Amelia Robinson, who is virtual through the end of last year, are back in the classroom. Robinson and Baker agree that this was a positive change. I work better at school because I'm better at, I don't have any discipline for myself. So I, when I'm in class and I sit down and I have to learn, that that makes me understand the stuff. It's a lot more social here, and um, I think I can understand teachers a lot better and pay attention in class instead of being on a Zoom call. Virtual learning may no longer be an option at LE, but students are still experiencing working from home due to quarantine. Today, as we meet the demons, we'll find out how many times these students have been quarantined. I'm Shana Turner, and I've been quarantined about once or twice last year, thankfully not this year, and um, quarantining to me is very difficult. It's a lot harder than it is in person to do the schoolwork and to get the grades up or keep the grades up and just like function and not see any of your friends or go out. Hi, I'm Asia Bovan. I've been quarantined twice. I didn't like quarantine because it was hard to keep up with my work. I'm Brooke Lassiter. I've been quarantined once and I hated it because I missed a lot of work and I didn't really know what was going on. Hi, my name is John Kuros and um, I'm a junior. I've been quarantined one time and it sucks being quarantined because you get lost in all your work and it's hard to catch up once you come back. And demons, please remember that if you are quarantined, it is not a vacation from school. 
log in and get your work completed, except for a more relaxed environment. This is Riley Slayton, signing off. Thank you.